My name is Stephen Nurkin. I'm an associate professor of surgery in the Department of Surgical Oncology here at Roswell Park Comprehensive Cancer Center. For the most part, men and women will experience similar signs and symptoms with colorectal cancer. Early on, you might not have any signs or symptoms. However, you could develop change in your bowel habits, such as diarrhea, constipation, narrowing of the stool, maybe changes in frequency or urgency of your stool, blood in your stool as well, um, and that could be either bright red blood or more dark digested blood. So other signs and symptoms to look out for in colorectal cancer, abdominal bloating, distension, abdominal pain or cramping. If there's anemia, you could have some weakness, fatigue, um, maybe a change in your appetite or a loss of appetite, and also some unexplained weight loss. Now some of the signs and symptoms related to maybe changes of your stool and bowel habits can be more um, infectious related, maybe a GI bug, sometimes bleeding in the stool can be related to other benign conditions such as hemorrhoids or something like that. But what we worry about are those signs and symptoms that are continuous, that don't go away, that are more chronic. That's when you should be evaluated by your physician. There has been an alarming rate of the increasing incidence of colorectal cancer in uh, early onset or early adults. Um, those are folks that are younger than 50 years of age. Some of their symptoms and uh, signs are just tossed off to um, maybe hemorrhoids or you know, you're having stress at work or those kind of things. And unfortunately, some of them are uh, then uh, often delayed in their diagnosis and come in uh, later on, even with later stage disease. So um, it's important to really know your body. Um, uh, be familiar with your bowel habits. I know sometimes these things are funny to talk about or silly or whatnot, but they're really critical. They're so important to know. Know your body. Look for some of those um, early warning signs.